and I was right. Red Bull won again with a gap of 7 tenths over Lando, but he won again. Max Verstappen won again. But I said in this video that Ferrari couldn't reach Red Bull, but they could reduce the gap. We've seen that. We saw that Leclerc had a medium pace of one tenth slower than Max Verstappen. Norris was equal or faster in the last laps, faster than Verstappen, but it was a McLaren track. It was a track that uh, favorites McLaren, favorite, favorites the, the concept, the spec of the McLaren's car. And uh, so I think that in a, in a track like Monaco, where uh, f there is more downforce, uh, a lot of high speed turns, corners, a track where everything is possible because it's a special track, you know, it's a, a track where qu qualifying is everything. It's a track where you make the difference with your ability like Imola. Imola is a track that needs good qualifying and uh, abilities, driver abilities. So it's Monaco. So. I think that Ferrari in Monaco will reach Red Bull, I think, in terms of pace, because Red Bull always demonstrated in this era, in this ground effect era, the Red Bull car in 2022, 2023 and 2024 demonstrated uh, a lack of pace. Uh, in tracks like Monaco, Singapore, all tracks that are um, street circuits and they demonstrated lack of pace. So Ferrari can reach Red Bull, but the uh, real question is, where will McLaren be? I'm saying that a week before the race. I'm really sure that Red Bull and Ferrari will battle for the qualifying pace but I think McLaren will be stronger like uh, Miami maybe because they demonstrated in Miami that they are stronger but in the, in the same time I think Ferrari can reach McLaren too yeah it's a nonsense you know but it is possible because if you think why this weekend Ferrari didn't make pole position analyzing the data the all the data that we have we can see that Ferrari lost everything in finish line straight so between the finish line and turn one that is turn two but you know the first corner so if you're losing the straight and you're in monaco ferrari can make the pole position if you think at that that makes sense if ferrari loses one tenth from mclaren only in this part of the lap and if it's like that, that's the possibility where Ferrari can win. If you think of that, it is possible. In terms of pace, I, uh, I see McLaren uh, the favorite team to win because Red Bull will struggle like the other years. In Monaco 2022, Ferrari was the faster, but the unbelievable Ferrari strategy ruined Leclerc race and Paris did win the race but this time and in 2023 Alonso would be there with Verstappen if they didn't pit two times Alonso was there with Verstappen for the win in Monaco at the 
beginning of the season so you know that's really really good we can see a, a, a slower Red Bull which lacks of pace and so we can see a McLaren won again maybe a one shot from McLaren maybe a, a win from Ferrari you don't know it's Monaco you know but I I'm saying that Imola, which is a Fer uh, uh, not a Ferrari track, but a McLaren track, I'm thinking that Ferrari upgrades are better than this. You know, we were 110 uh, from McLaren, and it's a solid little gap that, you know, you think Ferrari, in a track that is that not favorites its car, it can do better than that. Uh, without upgrades, McLaren outperformed Ferrari in China, you know, in the Chinese Grand Prix. And this time, Ferrari can do it in tracks that are normal, like maybe Silverstone, like maybe uh, the Spanish Grand Prix. You know, Ferrari has the pace. And if Ferrari has the pace, you don't have to be, oh, McLaren is ahead. Uh, Red Bull is ahead, Verstappen is, uh, is unbeatable by Ferrari, uh, Norris will win with Verstappen all the races. No, it's not like that, man. If I had to predict the race, I can't. I can't. Sorry, I can't this time. Uh, because, you know, it's impossible. It's Monaco. If Sainz goes to the wall, if Norris goes to the wall, if Leclerc goes to the wall, if Verstappen goes to the wall, you know, it's it's impossible. It's impossible to predict Monaco. It, the thing I can say is everyone can win in Monaco.